Hello everybody, welcome to this Ancestry stream today we're going to take a look at Arctic Pro. So, <clears throat> Arctic Pro has been out for ages and ages and ages, and I did actually review it when it came out. But it's very, very, very cool. So it made it to iOS 11 safe and sound. Um, yeah, so I'm going to give you a quick demo of some of the sounds and stuff, and also the other cool thing. Now, it's still, it's not an AU, okay, but, you know, what did we do before AU? We used Audio Bus, so I'm using Audio Bus. And uh, gonna just just to show that it still all works in the routing system and stuff like that, and it all does. So it's going into Cubase's. We're not doing a tracker out, just looking at the synth. Um, but just wanted to show you that it does actually all work in Audio Bus. So anyway, um, here we go. I'm gonna play some sass now. The very cool thing is this has a vocoder, and it's playable via the MIDI keyboard as well. So I'm gonna show you how to do that now. That is so so cool. Uh, and great so if you can't sing you can use the vocoder it's super duper so i'm going to close out the microphone blast through a few sounds then show you how to use the vocoder and stuff like that okay it's such a good synth Velocity is super cool, listen. So say for instance you wanted to use the vocoder, well, choose a sound that you want the vocoder to have that char characteristics of. Now some, sound, some sounds are better for vocoders and some sounds aren't, but you'll do this by trial and error. To access the vocoder it's real simple, you go to effects, there you'll make sure so you have all different these different effects. You can see if they're switched on or not by the active button or the little light beside the name. So we go to vocoder here. We can choose our input level, uh, and we, as soon as we activate it, it won't make any sound until we hit a key. So I'm going to close out the microphone so you'll hear what I mean. Now, oh, oh, hello. <clears throat> now you can see how cool that is, right? <clears throat> So as soon as we go back then, of course, then we could save that as a patch sort of thing. But we look in Sunshine Audios Bank, which comes with with it. There's a couple of, um, I think there's a couple of vocoder presets down here. Thank you. 
Now also this is because this is this is cool beans. I've got my MIDI keyboard plugged in. So I can still play all the keyboards. The Fogo that is getting picked up by the microphone, but it's not the quality of the mic that matters because it's then being processed through through the synth. Anyway, very cool beans. Here's a, a lead from Sunshine Bank. This is included, I think, as well. I just re-downloaded it. That's awesome. remember any sound that you want you can just go to the vocoder activate it <laughs> Alright guys, thanks for watching. I reckon it's worth checking it out. There'll be links in the description below anyway <clears throat> for Arctic Pro. I'll just show you quickly what else you get as well. Uh, you get, you know, your MIDI keyboard, uh, mixing keyboard setups and your arpeggiator and your low frequency oscillators. And you get your filter control section and then your envelopes as well. So, okay. So yeah, it's, it's I think it's really good. I think it's really, really great. It sounds, it sounds like a, it's a fabulous sounding synth, I think. And I, I, I go, it's, it, it's a rediscovery, you know what I mean? I rediscovered the synth. Um, yeah, so it's very cool. Check it out. And, uh, yeah, thanks for watching. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up or subscribe to the channel, please. Or consider becoming a patron, which is very, very, very cool. Okay, thank you very much. And I will see you later.